guys, welcome back. I am Jason Salyer, and we're here at Epic Shoot. I stepped off into the wood line because this is where I feel most at home. There's too many people over there, lots of loud noises, and I'm a very sensitive person. So I get questions a lot about how to deal with mosquitoes, deal with insects, and if you're in South Georgia, you're gonna have to deal with mosquitoes, insects, noceums, all that kind of stuff that's just gonna drive you insane. And if you're in a low-lying area like this with standing water, this nasty, mucky water, there's going to be mosquitoes, for, especially in the evening times, they get really, really bad. How do I deal with them? First, primarily, I wear long sleeves. I wear long pants and I wear long sleeves. If they get really bad, I'll even glove up. Um, I'll even cover my face up with um, sort of like a balaclava of some sort or a shemog. Works really, really good. Um, and if um, uh, on top of that, you could do some other, obviously DEET works but it's pretty poisonous and I don't genuinely like using that. I just prefer to put long sleeves on. Um, if you're around camp, what you can do is have yourself sort of a smudge fire. Whatever the predominant wind direction is, put that upwind of you a little bit so that smoke can loft in. Because in my experience, if you're not directly in the smoke itself, it doesn't do you much good. Just smoke in the area. Uh, when the mosquitoes are bad, it doesn't really help that much. You need to be literally in the smoke breathing it, unfortunately, but that's just the way it is. Um, permethrin is a good one, another kind of chemical type thing that I don't like using, but you can treat your clothes in permethrin. Spray your boots, spray your socks, your pants, everything down, let that dry. And then when you wear that stuff, it'll help keep the ticks and stuff like that, mosquitoes off of you. That's the things that have worked in my experience. Um, I've got a Sasquatch wandering friend back here that might have some more input for you, but let's see. Mosquitoes, so I'm just gonna cover the little less known stuff. Something I use really regularly, sagebrush sagebrush or any plant that's very very pungent like watercress could be used um mint something else something really spicy really if you burn that stuff the smoke will get rid of the mosquitoes sagebrush is all over the western united states there's no sagebrush around here unfortunately but if you can think of something pungent something really strong smelling you burn that stuff and the mosquitoes are out another thing i really like to use is yarrow yarrow you will see growing in your yard. I don't see any close, but if you use yarrow, you wad it up until you get the juices going, smashing all up and down your arms, and that helps deal with the mosquitoes as well. The last thing I'm gonna mention, I always like these long sleeve fishing uh, shirts. The shirts that you use to keep the sun off of you, they're thick enough, just thick enough that you can get wet, get dry, kind of do your thing in them, and it covers you. It gives you that layer to help prevent mosquitoes from eating. Love it. So we've both been in some really, really buggy environments before, and those are the things that have worked for us. Georgia's uh, bad. Georgia's real bad. Yeah. It's one of the worst. We, Southern Louisiana is really bad. Columbia was Maine bad was too. terrible. It's Maine gets those black fly yeah. Yeah. It's It's bad. So we've been in some buggy places, and that's what's worked for us. Anyway, if you've got some remedies that you know of that work really well and it's worked for you, leave that in the comments. Otherwise, make sure you subscribe if you haven't done so already. Hit the thumbs up, and we'll... Four thumbs up. Four thumbs up, and we'll see you next time.